Hey everyone, I'm Artosis and here I have Liquid Huck. He is in Korea. Finally I get to meet up with him. How do you like Korea so far? It's your first time over here. Uh, I like it a lot. The food, the girls, the people, my teammates, they're all really nice. So I love Korea. Those are good things to love, man. Absolutely. I agree with you there. Um, well, how do you like living in the OGS Team Liquid House so far? I don't think you've ever done anything quite like that. Um, I like it a lot. I mean, I guess my living conditions in Canada weren't that good because I, I like living here better than Canada. Uh, the food's really good. Uh, I sleep well for some reason over here better than in Canada. I don't, I don't know. I just, I think it helps me focus and I have no complaints thus far. Excellent. And uh, how are you getting along with your teammates? I know there's three uh, Team Liquid guys. You hang out with them a lot. You like them. You guys becoming good friends? Oh, yeah. All the Team Liquid guys, we're like big family. I don't like... Uh, it's really, really nice. We all get along. We all joke around. It's like we've known each other for a really long time, and some of us have. Um, and then OGS, I get along with all of them too, especially like Minchul and uh, Gone, Spunky, The Wind. I mean, everybody is really nice. So, yeah, it's great. Excellent. Well, uh, let's talk about today in the GSL. You're a great Protoss player, but what matchups are you not looking forward to? Um, I think my PVT is my best. I think PVP can be very chancy, and my PVZ is not great. So I think PVT, I'd be pretty good to win, and then PVZ and PVP kind of more shaky. But I expect to do well and qualify, hopefully. Excellent. Uh, you have any word on who's in your group or anything like that? No. Do you? I don't. I'm sorry. I wish I did. I would tell you immediately. Uh, all right. So, well, if you do make it into the round of 64, what are your goals for this GSL? Um, anything below top eight I would be upset with. Top eight I would be content with, and then winning I would be happy. So, uh, I don't know. I hope to win, obviously, but if I made S class, I'd be, you know, okay. So... All right, not quite as confident as Red, but still a good answer. All right, I'll let that one go. Um, so people have been <laughs> wondering about some of your little, your little quirks, like saying that you take showers all the time. And what's with this pillow? Can you want to explain a little bit about yourself here? Um, well, I have to use pillow and hoodie, or I play bad basically. Not hoodie so much anymore, I don't think, but the pillow, especially if the seats are really bad and low. Uh, and then yeah, I do take a lot of showers, and then. I guess I should clarify because everybody always asks. It, I don't take as many now that I'm in Korea. I maybe take two or three a day if I'm lucky. But I just like to do it to practice or to relax. So I'd like practice three hours and take a shower, eat, and relax, and think over strategies and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm not like a clean freak or anything by any means. But it's just to relax, I guess. Like a sauna. Like a sauna. No, I, I agree with you there, man. When I start losing games, I actually I take my sweaty nerd body, I go take a shower, and I, I win my next few games for sure. You feel a lot more comfortable then. But again, with the pillow, is this just something you want to put in your lap, or are you going to sit on it or something as a booster seat? No, I'm, I'm probably going to sit on it. It's happened. I mean, I think the chairs here are better. I didn't take a look. But the ones like at like MLG and ESL, they're like horrible chairs that are like really small and not cushioned enough and I don't know it's just better if I bring a pillow so and now I'm known for it so it's like my thing so I always bring a pillow forever forever yeah that's actually I used to bring a cushion to tournaments as well to make sure I was up high enough I like to lift my hands down yeah. all right well uh, any predictions about the remaining foreigners who's going through there's you Idra Rhett there's also a bunch of Chinese players here as well as players from Taiwan um it's going to matter a lot on who gets matched up with who. I mean, I think everybody can qualify. I think favorites are like me, Brett. I don't know who the Chinese players are. Like Lone or Sen, I assume they, they probably can. Uh, Idra can, obviously. It's just going to, you know, depend on what matchups we get and what players. And, you know, it's, it's a lot of it's luck. I mean, so we'll see. We'll see. All right. And any shout outs you got as we come to the end of this interview? Obviously, all my friends, family, uh, the little app factory com. Make sure to check out there because they have great apps, and you need to download them. Uh, TeamLiquid.net. Uh, all my Korean fans, uh, all my teammates, all my OGS teammates. You know, everybody. Artosis, of course, for doing this interview with great coverage. Um, I don't know if I forgot anybody. You know, love you. Whatever. Bye. Big heart. So. All right, man. Thank you for the interview once again. Good luck. Thank you.